Hello up, guys, what's up? It's us. It's uh, your boys. We out here fighting birds. We bird battling it up, <clears throat> doing what people do to birds. Punch them in their bird faces. Well, we just slash them with swords. Yeah, that's right. We're using <laughs> yeah. a swordsman. I couldn't remember. Dude, like two hits and he's done. That's right. Link is so... This is the fatalist Link that's ever been. So far. If we get another upgrade that powers up the swords even more... Yeah. Like, he's... He's gonna walk. He's gonna moonwalk his way through everything. Shoigoi. Um, he's just... My just the me brawler. Yeah, the Shoigoi. His boy. outfit. He's the same colors. I know, it's an adorable. Oh, and there's also Mega Man and... Oh, it's all of... Oh, because they're all shy guys. That's clever. I like that. I really... I know we keep saying this, but like... Good everyone job. is here! Dude, yeah, seriously, everyone is here. Like, represented in some form or another. Yeah. It's just neat to keep... I love how much that blows you away. Like, like every single... Like, almost every episode you say, you, you say like, I know I say this all the time, but like, everyone really is here. It just feels that way, like... Yeah. I don't know, like, every time they have a card that's like, oh... I know what series that's from, and like, that's an interesting way to portray these guys, and then you see them portrayed, and you're just like, oh, I get it, because in The Legend of Zelda, these guys usually walk around with a stick, so they gave him, well, in this yeah. case, they gave him super-powered swords, but that dude's got a big old... They're doing as well, as much as they can. Yeah, within the realms of the game. I don't know, that's, it's, it's a little... There we go. Thank you from Nintendo. There you go. Maybe not from Nintendo, but from Nintendo. To Nintendo. Thank you, to Nintendo. From me. <clears throat> Dude, honestly, like, this game is, like, on easy mode with, like, all the spirits that you have, like, attached to Link. Oh, yeah. Like, I, I Jesus mean... Jesus Christ. Who really wants to struggle? Like, who's out there, like, man, you know what my favorite part of the game is? Struggling, Struggling. and repeating shit. Like, this game being too hard to have fun with. He's invisible. Just, like, his social presence. Actually, that was a bad joke. That's really sad, dude. Yeah, that wasn't a good one. No, I'm just it's kidding. It's been like, he's invisible, just like Sonic Forces. Dude, stop it. People like Sonic <laughs> Forces. People, not me, but some people. Yeah. You mean furries? I think furries like Sonic Forces. Oh, they're all invisible. Comment down below if you thought Sonic Forces was good. Also, if you thought Sonic Forces was better than Mania. Because I thought Mania was fantastic. I'm still in the midst of playing that. Because I only got it recently. Eat it. I love that game. I really well, do love it's it. It's one of my favorite games. We may have to bring that on just because, like, uh, my first console ever was a Sega. So I started off Sega like... Sega Genesis or, like, Master System? Uh, Master System first, and then I got the Genesis. Um, there we go. Invisible. But yeah, dude, so, like, my first play. game I remember playing uh, was <clears throat> Sonic. And I remember my mom going... She was unable to watch because it would make her nauseous at how fast he moved. Uh huh. And I was just like, "Yeah, he moves fast, and only kids can watch him because we're cool." And like, <laughs> and like now you get nauseous with everything. Yeah. Single game. <laughs> now all the three D games make me nauseous, and I'm like, "Damn it, it's come for full circle." I just realized we never activated this thing. It's probably fine. Oh, oh and then you can do the little the gate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There, we did it. What's over in there? It looks like an arena of some type. I don't know yet. It also doesn't look like it's too far from you. Oh. Hey, you get a free treasure chase. We've opened the path. Go get that. Go that get is that an Overwatch reference. Oh, let me just do this one really quick. Okay. God, oh, dude, those fairies ace. are terrifying. I mean, they look slightly more <clears throat> okay drawn. Drawn. But, like, <clears throat> I still remember seeing that movement. fairy in the N64 version and just being, like, really creeped out. Like, I don't know, there's there's something about that specific style of them. I don't know. Yeah. I know some people were like, oh, nice, and like, fairy boobs, but like, just the way that they were drawn oh, always dude. really creeped me out. But oh, dude, you weren't a fan of like, fairy boobs? Come on, dude. I mean, who's not a fan of fairy boobs, but like... I mean, look at that. In that in that particular instance, they happen those to... Those polygonal fairy boobs <laughs> from the N64. Yeah, you could cut glass with those things. Dude, she is, like, on one. She's got dual swords. Or maybe just one sword, but... More swords than she normally has. Her sword-having ability has increased 100%. And she's using it. There we go. Well, she was using it. Health wow, recovery. she healed herself all the way to the death. Yeah, dude. That would have been bad. 
You recover a great deal of health on a certain something. You already know what's up. That seems like a good thing to add into the arsenal. It might be. But I didn't read the entire thing. I don't know if it heals the entire thing or just partial. I don't know. It said it heals a great deal. <gasps> nice. Nice. More music. Dude, I love collecting the music tracks. And ever since you showed me that you can pick your song for every stage. For every stage, like, yeah. That's so much fun. Now every single stage has Crush 40. Rolling around <laughs> at the speed of sound. Well, all the Sonic stages. No, every stage that I can put it on. Which is probably just every Sonic. Oh, there's a game of Pong going on. I'm sure it'll be fine. Does it affect them too, or just you? Looks like just you. Just me. Oh, you lucky boy, you. Even the sticks seem to block your path. Yeah. You got this, though. What is he he's representing? It's, oh, it's a uh, tennis. Yeah, Mario. That's why they got the couples for the... The doubles? Yeah. Nice. There you go. Uh-oh. And that's also why we got the Pong. That is why we got the Pong. Get hit by the thing. Oh, you would've got hit by it. Look at that trajectory. I'd probably die. Grants a 5% chance to land devastating critical hit. Ooh, that's pretty cool. That's... That's decent. I guess. Yeah. <clears throat> that's good if you compare it to bullshit. <laughs> What'd you get? More soundtrack? I hope so. It's Ooh, a chomp, chomp hat. hat. That's actually pretty cool. I like that. Buzz Buzz, this is a hilarious battle. This is so... Tiny Mr. Game and Watch? Tiny yeah. battle. That's the only condition. I think I had you play this off camera. We were in the spirit board. Was it? Yeah, we, we had just played a four star that had like KO'd us in a second. And then I was like, play this one. It's so easy. <laughs> it's so stupid easy. That's so cute. Because he's tiny and... What he game has, is he from? I don't even know. I didn't look at it, but he's like pixelated, so I imagine he's from an earlier game. Maybe he's just too small to draw out. Yeah. Hey, there's a town down there. Oh, wait. Oh, I guess I don't get to have fun. Dude, that rock is... I mean, that rock. The master hands are kind of a dick in this. They're like, not letting you do anything. Yeah, let, let's check out this pipe. Do it. Check out the pipage. Where does this take me? Oh, this takes you right to the place. Oh, yeah, immediately. Weird. Freezy. I have a thing that immune... Well, you don't need immunity. You, you'll, you'll kill them. But there's a thing that I have that makes you immune to being frozen. And freeze type stuff. And freeze type stuffs. Which basically makes the ice climbers <clears throat> what they've always been. Useless. Useless. Although they might, <laughs> they might have a little bit of a game-winning fury going on. I don't know if anybody else does this, but every time I fight the ice climbers, I usually try to make it a personal goal to separate them and then kill only one. Uh huh. And then just not let the other one hit me for a while, like I'm taunting him that I just killed his sister, and then I kill him. Like you're just like, what are you gonna do now? You're useless. Yeah. You ain't got your partner. Yeah. I don't know why. I, I've done that ever since I saw them in melee. So I didn't like them in melee, so. I would, I would go out of my way to, to torture them. Oh, dude, there's a shop down there. Oh, hey, Rover. And there's Rover. Take your strongest into this no-frills battle. My strongest? Yeah. See that? No-frills. No-frills for the grills. What does that mean, no-frills? Just That means there's no-frills on this, this uh, blouse. Oh, I remember this fight. This fight sucks. Because they just keep spamming side B. Which is really annoying. They do it every chance they get. As soon as they're able, they will side B. Which is Oh shit, dumb. get that shit away from me. Is that tree like an instant KO? Mm, not instant KO, but it does a lot of damage. Watch out. Get yourself. There's about to be another train getting pummeled into that one. You got coal. Maybe if you blow up the coal, you'll... Uh, ignite a chain reaction and you'll kill everybody. Well, probably not because it doesn't look like it's very interactable. There you go. Get that food. I don't hey, even I know think... what killed that one. I don't know, but take it. Last one. Last one on the chopping block. God, that stupid side B. They just love to spam it. There, there it we is. Go. Nice. Oh, I guess. Oh, this. This guy just won't give up. There we nice. go. Nice. 
That's a weird up stab. Did you see that? He just kind of like... Like two-handed up with his... I don't know. Oh, look. Would you look at this? Ice floor immunity. Hey. Nice. It's nice to not be affected by ice. I knew you were going to say that. Thank you. <laughs> that, that's just your inner squirrel you get force me. coming out? <laughs> I guess. I don't know. I, I just like rhyming things together. I was trying to figure out a way to incorporate lice into it. Really? Yeah, because <laughs> they look like rice. I, 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 uh, if you guys could only see the happiness drain from Christian's face as I said that. He was waiting for a genuine moment of sincerity and nope, it was just things that rhyme. I'm just out here. <laughs> I'm just... I'm just always thrown off by like your use, your vernacular. Thank you. <laughs> like, specifically when you say like when you rhyme things, because I'm just like, huh? Yeah. Like, I'm just not used to anyone speaking with such a flow, you know? Thank you. It, like, throws me off. What is this? Brick wall. Oh. Increase okay. defense, lower offense. Why does everything lower offense? I just want something that increases offense. Ginger. Oh, and he's supposed to be Ginger. Oh, we have anti-sleep. I would switch it up for the bottom one. Move speed. Uh, I forget who does it. One of these guys does it. There's Ho-Ho. Oh, Ho-Ho -Oh gives you an extra jump. Oh, yeah. This is for oh, sure. there's Tingle. There's Tingle, yeah. Slumber music. His creepy-ass face. I've never liked Tingle. <clears throat> Why in, not, dude? He doesn't, he doesn't do anything. He's a creepy middle-aged guy in a green suit that wants to be a fairy. I don't know. Every, every time he's ever introduced... That sounds like the real world. I mean, yeah, you probably find a couple Tingles if you walk down the street, but... Did he just... Oh, I was about to say... That was, like, super easy. I don't know. Something about Tingle has always creeped me out. Like, I first met him in the Wind Waker series. Uh-huh. And in that one, he's he's just kind of weird. He always talks about, like, my dad hates that I'm a fairy. And I'm like... Is it, is, I feel like there's a subliminal message somewhere in like, there. Is someone projecting through <laughs> yeah. Tingle? Like, I don't know. There's, there's something about it that just always stuck to me as, like, a little bit off. And I could never quite point it down. I was like... Is this is this sexual, or is this is this like a metaphor? Hey. Oh. Oh, this one's. I left, I have her already. Left, left right. And right oh no! Switch that. Reverse. Fuck that. And we have left right left right left immunity. Uh, just switch out the Z slumber. Oh god! I keep messing up. Sorry. Right. I do this every time I'm in this stupid menu. There we go. You're not alone. Which? There, oh, there's the girl up there. Up one, to the left. Oh, there we go. She is makes you immune to that thing. She is, makes and you, you still immune. get to keep your sword weapon attack boost and your other weapon attack boost because that's the main card. You ready? Let's do See, this. See, look at his 3D nose. That's also not 3D. It, I mean, it and looks 3D. It bothers you. Me. Can tell there's depth in it. Yeah, I don't know. It's just always bugged me. No. Oh shit. Actually, I think it's just. Oh, it's slow. Yeah. Can you jump out of it and be regular? Stupid Ridley. Now you're invisible. What the fuck? What happened? I think he grabbed you and just drug that you That threw me off. I did yeah, not see that happen. I was, I was kind of focusing on what she was doing and then all of a sudden... I get dragged off stage invisible. Yeah, <laughs> just dragged into hell. Gosh. I think the key is to kill Ridley before she can really do anything to you. Oh, I take continuous damage in the aura. Oh, stay out of that aura. Although he's going to want to try to fight you in it. Down A. For the win. Nice. Good attempt, good attempt. Watch out for his drag you to hell move. Which apparently he has. There you go. Oh, what? She's also a... I didn't know she was a CPU. No, oh, this, this is a me fighter. Oh, okay. Dude, they, they keep throwing me off with these guys. Like, I, I keep thinking that they're in-game PCs, but, like, they're... Like, this is a sword fighter. Yeah, this is a sword fighter. Yeah, he's using uh, Ashley Staff from yeah. the WarioWare series. I think that's cool. That's a nice... It's a nice way to put in fighters that aren't necessarily in there. There it is. Watch that foot. <laughs> 
Both of you are now me oh good. You're both metal. That'll certainly help. I don't know. I, Get I, I like the meat fighters. I know they're not particularly like viable, but there's a lot of fun things you can do with them, I feel. There we go. Yeah, they're very customizable. Yeah. I know people don't use them a lot just because I don't know. Just because I don't think they look like generally interesting or like a character that anyone would want to it use. It is hard to make them interesting. For yeah, I mean, sure. like, like you can make them like other characters. Like Jay over here made a Deku one. I did. We might have to show that off at one point. Yeah, he made a Deku one. So like, it's interesting that people make things like that. Or you can also like just customize them, just make them like other people. Because I know there's skins like there's the Ashley one right here. Yeah. And there's also one for Zero. Oh yeah, there is one for Zero. I forgot about that. And there's like the the Mex. I hate Lucas so much. The faster you kill him, the happier I will be. There he goes. Oh, he dodged the last second, but not good enough. There we go. Get the fuck out of here, Lucas. What, dude, you don't like characters from Mother 3? I, he just beat the crap out of me when I was trying to unlock him. Oh, really? And so, like, most things in this game, I hold a grudge. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, that's 100% of my dislike of a character is how much trouble I had unlocking them. Min Min. She's got a gun and a ball. From the hit series Arms, which I have yet to play. You mean Springy Fisto? Springy as they say in Fisto. the UK? Oh, it's that girl. I don't like her. Horrid. Yeah, I hate fighting her. I think she's stupid. Dude, stop it. You're leaving Dragon. My oh, no! Here, let me beat up on her. I actually, I hate her enough to work. Why are you talking crap about her <laughs> Dragon Waifu, man? Come on. Is she? She's huh? not. Oh, this is the girl that you were saying was the shoeless waifu. Yeah, look at okay, her. She, she doesn't right. wear shoes. Oh, yeah, you're right. That's weird. Wear some shoes. You creepy creep. She's literally everything that somebody wants in a waifu. Shoeless and a dragon. <laughs> oh, my two favorite things combined. How'd they know that I like both lack of shoes? Stop hitting me with that stupid thing. And dragons. Die. I, I, I still don't... I don't know. Maybe I'm not meant to understand that. When someone's like, there's this big, like, when they did the Five Nights at Freddy's, and, like, <clears throat> immediately Five Nights at Freddy's got, like, weirdly sexualized, and... What, dude, have you never had a thing for animatronics? No. Me either, they fucking scare me. <laughs> they're not, yeah, being... they're not friendly. I don't get it, like, I, maybe I'm not supposed to get it, but, like, I know that that was a big part of, like, the drawback of that fandom, is, like, it was cool... Because I would watch, like, the game theory and find out, like, the backstory and stuff like yeah. that. But then, like, you would see the fandom and, like, the fandom kind of ruined it a little bit. Falco. Oh, you know what we need to do? We need to take off the, the immunity. Oh, yeah. That's why I'm losing. In fact, if I lose, that's why I lost. In fact. It's not because somebody outclassed me. Oh, my God. Dang, dude. Have you noticed how the community for this game just outright just really dislikes Isabel. Really? I think it's so funny. And all the Isabel mains be like, I'm so good at edge guarding. All they do is side B and throw out the fishing rod. I hate that fishing rod so much. Oh my god, yeah. It's because they didn't have the right cards. Yeah. Really, this card, I mean, this game's built around the cards, so like, if you're not playing the right cards, yeah. it doesn't matter how well you play, like, I was playing really, really well. Everyone says like so. There, there is no way you could have beat that. No, at all. it's not physically possible. Uh, what's the other guy I usually use? Is it coughing? Okay. Fire and explosion attack? We'll roll with that. Oh, so that's wheezing, not coughing. Oh, yeah, that is wheezing. <coughs> it's set up for Roy, but it works for Lonk really well. In IMHO. Mm-hmm. But yeah, now that I have the right cards, I mean, I'm totally going to beat. Watch. First try. Take this bomb. First try. The first, the other first try didn't didn't, didn't actually work. This no. first try though. This is the true first try. Oh my gosh, it's eating food and covering health. This is actually kind of difficult. They're like, they're they're competent enough to be kicking my ass, which is not super competent, but competent enough to where I'm worried. There we go. There's one. Get off of me, Holmes. Come on. There you go. There we go, see? And just like that, you know, it's really all the cards. You don't... Immunity Slumber to immunity. I want immunity to electric floors, damn it. 
It's the one we don't have yet. <clears throat> Dang, dude. Did you know that Pikachu debuted in 2000? I thought he debuted in like 96 when Pokemon came out. I don't know, it said 2000 right there. Unless I'm wrong. They may be talking about- oh, wait, wait. They didn't get the chest. The chest. Sweet! Dang, Look at these dude. delicious snacks. If you guys stick with us on the next episode, we're going to eat all these de delicious snacks. See you then.